starting in three, two, one, go! Red Alliance with a beautiful partnership between MSET Fish and the Wild Hats. Team 649 taking off first from the level one, followed by 100. They then quickly place those hatch panels. We are now out of the sandstorm period. Drivers can see the light of day. Cheesy Poofs and Soda Cyber Dragons. A little bit of bumper to bumper action over on the blue side of the planet. Cheesy Poofs pick up a hatch panel with their turreted design. Raise up to level three of their far side rocket ship and they will successfully place that hatch for two points for the red, or blue, excuse me. Scores now tied, 21 all. Red Alliance trying their best to score on their rocket. Running into a little bit of trouble from the Misfits and their robot Eris. This is a very close match. Blue Alliance holding on to their lead, 23-21. Near side of the field, we're gonna find much of the action. Two Red Alliance robots with blue defending. That all girls team, 64-18, doing a fantastic job playing defense, trying to hold them back while the cheesy poofs score. Into the Blue Alliance cargo ship. Team 5700. Have their eyes set on the poofs. 45 seconds remain in qualification match number 10. Wild Hats with a hatch panel in place. They're raising it up high, nearly tipping over once and back, but they successfully right themselves. That amazing skill of their drivers, keeping that robot upright as we now land at the 20 second mark. Teams preparing their in-game strategies. Cheesy Poofs joining 68-14. Their robot, Epimetheus, on the Blue Alliance have. Team 649 effortlessly climbs onto the level two platform for the Red Alliance. Three seconds left to go. The Poofs are on level three. All six robots sitting on their respective alliances halves. This match is over. Will be the Blue Alliance. 77 to 43. Blue Alliance with three rank points, two for the win, one for the hab climb. That was a good match played all around.